You need a new moose head for your den? How about a couple of hundred plates for your kitchen cabinet? A local restaurant's stuffed stuff and other stuff is going on the auction block. NBC 10's Dan Jaden got a preview tonight. Dan, that bear is as big as you. Gene, I think this would look beautiful in your living room. Well, what do you think? I'll see how it goes. <laughs> yeah, see how that goes at home, huh? But really, where else could you get something like this? It is a conversation piece and a piece of local history. All of what made Bugaboo Creek a big attraction will become history on the auction block in Seekonk this Saturday. But what about the talking moose? Hail, hail, the gang's all here, but not for long. What stared at you while you ate could soon be yours for good. Their old stomping ground bankrupt, and in a sign of the times, all that hung from the walls of Bugaboo Creek is up for auction. Wow. This is going to be fun. Auctioneer Michael Salvador will be looking for the highest bid on items from everything in the kitchen, including the silverware, stoves, and, well, look around. You just don't see these things every day, from photos to bear traps to, to, to well, you get it. You won't be able to find full animal mounts and the types of uh, historical items or reproductions that you'll find here. You won't, you won't find them in any other restaurant because Bugaboo Creek Steakhouse was a different type of a place. How would this look on your living room wall? There actually, there's quite a few items that have some real vintage value to them. Um, a lot of the pictures, some of the taxidermy, and the traps are quite old. Some of those are nice, the big bad traps. If you've ever been here, you're probably wondering, where's the talking moose? He's not talking. No one's saying a word. It appears the talking moose and the moving raccoon moved on. No one seems to know just where they are. Who goosed the moose? We don't know. <laughs> we think it's in another restaurant. Really? Someone took it? Yes. Yeah. But and the police have been notified. <laughs> <laughs> and Raccoon? And Rocky and Bullwinkle are on it. <laughs> so nothing will talk back, but people will sure talk about a real conversation piece that can be yours if you can bear to make the bid. And this is going to be a good opportunity for some people to acquire things for their own little man cave, if you right. will. Or woman cave. Let's be fair. The viewing will be held Friday from 11 to 6 and Saturday from 8.30 to 10.15. The auction, Saturday morning, 10.30 at the former restaurant on Route 6 in Seekonk. It's open to the public. If you have some time and you live around the area, it might be just cool to go swing by and see some of the things. Not Your Average Joe's slated to move into the building next. We're live in the newsroom tonight. Dan Janik, NBC 10 News.